Get ready, and watch your backs. Leave it to me! Not a scratch. Help me improve! The sword is like water. It cannot remain still. Strike the park! See it in action? I'm on guard. I want to protect everyone too. Help me, Mr. Sora! Lance ablaze! Lance! Forward! of the Skyfaring Commission, allow me to welcome you to Starskiff Haven. On the Sienjo Lofu, anything relating to aviation, navigation, and trade falls within the scope of the Skyfaring. You definitely sound like that's too kind of you. My anyway, we're safe. Palace of Astrum? 
right there, the tallest building in the city. It's also the headquarters of the Sky Ferrying Commission. Let's hurry, we haven't got much time. I don't mean to rush you, but if you sound scared... We need to make a few preparations before paying a visit to any of the six commissions. Rest assured. Very well. <laughs> Little Miss Fox. That might she did the right thing. Nuts, I She is it? No, why did we careless? Oh crud. Good idea. Let's Are you not? I've brought the map. Yes, madam. Report the losses to General Jing Yuan and find someone from the Divination Commission. I can't just stand there watching while we deal with this mess. Greetings, guests from the Astral Express. Ting Yun has informed me of the purpose of your visit. Receiving guests isn't normally one of my responsibilities. But since you know about the Stellaron and have stated that you want to help the Law Fu, and politely decline your proposal. The Sienjo Alliance knows what a Stellaron is, and is more than capable of handling it ourselves. We have been around for over 8,000 years, and weathered countless dangers and crises. While the situation is serious, we have more than enough resources to spare. Outside of you are guests- From what we've- If we can locate- We have experience in preventing Stellaron disasters, and we've only come here to lend you that experience. I've said this, and I'll say it again. 
This is an internal affair of the Sienjo Alliance, and there is no need for the Astral Express to get involved. I decided to arrange a meeting with you as a gesture of respect. Uh, but... Never mind, Mr. I'm afraid that's imp- Huh? And what's that supposed to mean? It's only been a few days since the presence of a Stellaron was detected on the Law Fu. Starskiff Haven has been under full lockdown. No one has been permitted to leave. How did you- I acquired the access history of Starskiff Haven. Not long ago, someone hacked into the system and opened the Jade Gate. Before guiding the hacker was skilled- What say you in your defense? You are forbidden from leaving the sky. Don't be too harsh, you gone. If this gets out, the whole galaxy will think the Alliance has forgotten how to treat our guests. General Jing Yuan. It's very unlikely that the Express has joined forces with the Stellaron Hunters. They are. Apologies for interrupting your meeting. My name is Jing Yuan. General, this is an interruption. I fully agree with you, Helm Master Yu Kong. I am sorry, guests of the Astral Express. It is true that there is a Stellaron on the Lofu, but I'm afraid I cannot accept your kind offer to- Of course, it would be inappropriate of me to let you return without something to show for it. While I cannot accept your help with regard to the Stellaron, I do have a favor to ask. Please, after you. Ah, the Astral Express. I must confess that the train's reputation precedes it, such that it is often close to my thoughts. It's enough. Uh, during our... I have... As such. We can handle since doing. <laughs> if you are able to capture this Stellaron hunter, the Sienjo will be indebted to you. The Lofu never fails to reward that which is given. Okay. Wonderful. It's a deal then. I shall notify Yu Kong that all intel is to be shared with you, and that our best personnel are to aid you in your search. If there's anything the Skyfaring Commission or the Cloud Knights can do for you during your stay, don't hesitate to make it known. Therefore, that's why now that we figure. Master Diviner, you heard our discussion. What do you make of it? What do I make of it? The way of heaven is apparent, but the heart of humanity is often deceptive. Are you asking me to divine our true intentions? That won't be necessary. The crew has nothing to do with the incident. Of that, I am almost certain. It isn't their intentions that trouble me. All I want is for them to lure out the one we're after. Wasn't that my idea, General? Indeed. Your counsel has always been a great help to me. You may use your discretion on the matters ahead of us. Hmm. Why don't you retire early and I use my discretion full time? 
<laughs> it is still too soon, unfortunately. If something goes wrong, you'll need a general to take the blame. How could I simply walk away and put you at such risk? If you'd brought me that blade earlier, none of this would have been necessary. Wait, what are you up to exactly? Xing Yuan, did you let him escape on purpose? Me? <laughs> I had no idea he might escape. Unlike you, my gaze never tr- I can understand. On the yes, yes, yes. I have to go now. I'll leave this in your overwhelmingly capable hands, Fu Shen. <sighs> there are General Diviner. She is very capable. This Stalaron thing. I can understand your impatience, and I know you want to prove yourself. Now is not the time. If you truly wish to become sword champion, you shouldn't be running around brandishing your sword at people. Especially not a major criminal. You think I'd lose to Blade? I'm saying you need to have patience, Yan Ching. Governing Xianzhou is different from a sword fight. The only way to build momentum is to work slowly. Besides, we still don't know who's really moving the chess pieces. There is something we must take care of before making our next move. As long as it remains unresolved, we're at a stalemate. That something is the Stellaron. How did it manage to bypass the Skyfaring Commission's inspections and the Divination Commission's predictions? Where is it now? I say we bring those two Stellaron hunters before Diviner Fu. She'll get an answer out of them in no time. I've asked our friends from the Express to take care of that for us. Worry not, you are my most trusted. <laughs> But I suppose it is my fear is that this one. to be in each other's company. The Skyfaring Commission has reserved rooms for you at the Petrichor Inn. When you finish your business here, how about some tea together? already. Jokes aside, did you see Madame Yukong frown at us? I thought her guards were about- oh, I'd rather deal with monsters than these big shots. Uh, uh, I mean, 
N not that Madam Yukong doesn't have her merits. <laughs> Don't worry, my lips are sealed. But as her subordinate, I have to say that it's Madame Yukong's duty to keep her guard up. The Law Fu is facing a crisis, and as head of the Sky Faring, she's actually a very reasonable old girl in private. Eventually, she... In any case, Madam Yukong instructed me to reserve the best rooms at the inn. She specifically mentioned that if you wish to buy anything at the inn, be it food or otherwise, just let the innkeeper know. The commission will cover the cost. Why don't you go back your... Ahem. <clears throat> Seeing as our hosts are so thoughtful, I guess we should help ourselves. Right, Mr. Yang? We should focus on our objective first. Seeing as Hellmaster Yukong was extreme... Exactly right. But as cunning as she is... Here are the coordinates. Our destinations may differ, but the orbits of the stars will eventually converge. See you later. Don't let her words... That's the sound of- Uh, which means what exactly? This is a starship. There are all kinds of devices in this march. To the untrained ear, these noises may sound the same, but for the craftsmen of the artist the general sent for now, get some rest and prepare yourselves for the operation ahead. I look forward to seeing you in action. Let's take... Oh, more in... You've been standing here for half an hour. Are you worried? <sighs> Himiko, can I have a look? Sure. Not to mention an unexpected... <sighs> what exactly are you... Stop speaking in riddles. <sighs> it's simple. But... Stop! Do you know him? The Xianzhou is in danger. <laughs> if he's on the ship, then Welt, March, and him. Everyone is in grave danger! But... Is he... connected to that past you want to escape? I... I can't leave them down there. It's just... Is there anyone who doesn't... We tread on a path that... Try not to dwell on it, Don Hung. The Express been... Pom Pom and I are more than... If there's something you've got to do... And you'll come back and travel with us once this is all over, right?
Virtually nothing has changed since I left. This is Apart from darkness. A conflict with Stay where you are. I can emergencies should be dealt with by Life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break! Don't hesitate. The truth of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break! Fighting is meaningless. Strikes first. I'll Are you 
two okay? Good. I'm Sushong of the Cloud Knights. I was just transferred here from the Yaoqing. I did tell you to let me handle it. I don't have eyes in the back of my head. What if I accidentally hit you? Forgive me, miss, but you were too busy being hit yourself. It's a good thing I joined the fray. <laughs> I was protecting you, more like. It's a Cloud Knight's job to protect others. And this area is under martial law. I'm escorting all civilians to safety. Follow me. That was some impressive Cloud Knight spearmanship. Which unit are you from? Miss Sushang, what exactly has transpired? I, uh, I can't comment on that. I was just ordered to rescue the civilians. Actually, I have no idea either. You're pretty quiet. My name is Dan Hung. No can do, mister. It's way too late. You won't find anyone at Starskip Haven. If your friends made it out, then they'll already be in the safe zone. No need to worry. We'll see them when we get there. Aren't you going to take my name too? Miss? You already said it when. Let's go. Stay close, you two. Cloud Knight Sushang. Oh, and one more thing. I need you to write your names down later. I don't know too many characters. I might make a mistake. Message not sent? Why not? Long ring doesn't seem in that case. Think you get away with your crime by returning? Oh, you now I'm star just like with Mamas. <laughs> I wouldn't say. Shall we, my thing? Now what's a hunt without a hound? Kafka is still at large, and the Skyfaring Commission wants this problem to go away. I made a few calls and managed to procure this from the Artisanship Commission. Perfect for hunting down suspects. Exactly. Are we gonna set him loose on Kafka? Yes and no. This is Deeting, a bionic dog developed by the Artisanship Commission. He has all the five senses of the Foxian race and takes them to another level. Be it tracks or all we need to do. But before we get started, let's to begin with, let's tell Deeting to find. Follow these sparkly traces to find Miss Ting Yoon, right? She's not in a hurry, that's for sure. Playing hide and seek with us while. The traces. Got it. That's. Using the. Or we. <laughs> Miss Tin Yoon 
must have left us these clues, right? Deeding should be able to pick up her traces now. You found me! If you pick up traces... Stargazer Navalia might become so quiet. Long were the nights when the clangor of hammers rose to meet the stars. People used to write poems about the shipwrights here. The Lawfu relies on the star skiffs produced here to transport people and goods. Now that work in the shipyard has stopped, our internal transport and outbound flights might also grind to a halt. You don't seem to... I wouldn't say that. A good businesswoman doesn't just warn you. If we do run into Kafka, you'll have to do the fighting benefactors. I'd love to help, but there's very little I can do. Not a lot of people out there could have fought the Mara struck like you did. We Foxians. Besides, I was never much of... I'll definitely be... Understood. We won't put when we run into Kafka. We... Before D Ting can start tracking, you'll have to feed him some leads. If Kafka is hiding in Stargazer Navalia, she'll have left behind traces. Let's spread out and look for them. Leave no stone unturned. Of it must have been. Mr. Swarog. <laughs> oh.
Tang smells something. A bright edge that can cut jade. And the stars shift within it. A fine sword indeed. Bright edge that can cut jade, and the stars shift within it. A fine sword indeed. What's this? A jade that looks like. We should have enough clues here to get Deedin on the move. No. No time to lose. Let's give him the scent and let him lead the way. I think we've rounded up all our suspicious clues. But did Kafka leave them behind on accident? Uh, she's sure on uh, making. Don't forget. Let's go, Ben.
Well, when the trace of the hunted disappears, the hunter... It might mean the tables have turned. Kafka! These cloud knights aren't... Just a little persuasion to get them to listen to me. But you know all about that already, don't you? What a hassle. This place is too far for the Diviner. See you up ahead. like water. It cannot remain still.
<laughs> so close and yet so far. You'll have. Uh, there's no way through here. We need to think of a way to cut her off. Don't worry about locked doors, benefactors. We can use the conveyor belts.
Welcome, Astralix. <laughs> Admit it, Kafka. You planned for us to come here. Well, I didn't plan it. You speak too highly of- <laughs> Best future? Best for who? If I said best for the universe, would you believe me? <laughs> We're taking you to- Oh, thanks. We don't have much time. If I were you, I'd make a move before it's too late. Divination Commission. I'll be taking the criminal from here. Greetings, crew of the Astral Express. This is our first encounter. Far-flung friends ought to be received with fine wine. But alas, what the act? We received. <laughs> Understood. Oh, that guy. We won't. Very well. I uh, can't. While uh, the time has. A Disembark here, benefactors. Uh, why did you bring us here? No need to yell, Master Diviner. The Meridian Pin is malfunctioning, and I couldn't find the entrance to the look. Exalting Sanctum. This is a safe place. Let's just walk the rest of the way from here. Our hexagrammatic position. I heard the Sienjo can tell your fortune. Is that how they do it? Anyone can count on their fingers. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm... I just performed some quick divination, and the hexagram is consistent with our current predicament. 
The Starscuff cannot take us to the Divination Commission today. Alas, without me and- It's true! The Divin- uh, That's why you have to develop your talent pool, otherwise ever- <laughs> Since you are clearly ignorant of the Commission's eternal affairs, I shall absolve you of your ridiculous remarks. You? Really? Um, you might not want to hear this, but your general gave us his word. <sighs> to have this prisoner speak, the commission must resort to unconventional means. The need I have appointed someone to wait for you in front of exalting saint- Uh, oh? Don't take it to- Really? Uh, okay. Yeah! That's the plaza. But... Uh, I can't see it. What's oh, going on with what it? What is that? <laughs> teach you a lesson. Ready to lie down now? <sighs> Thanks for helping to stabilize the assertive sedation techniques. However, these cloud knights were already sick, and now they're injured too. I've got to bandage up their wounds, realign their bones, Ugh, as if I didn't have enough on my plate. Where did you come from, little one? Is your... I don't have a dad. Uh, what if... I don't have a mom either. Uh, I get it. You think... The... Huh? <laughs> Welcome to the Xian Show, my... I've been studying the... Galabog kids are making... Things haven't been very peaceful in the lawful recently. <laughs> Go running around. <sighs> well, seeing as you saved me just now, if you're unlucky enough to acquire any breaks or sprains, I'll treat you for free. Ha! If I hadn't left my purse at... <laughs> Enough of that. Our little miracle worker seems very different from everyone else around. Don't you think, Mr. Yang? So this is the Vidyadara. Hurry! Remember? Yeah, yeah. Do you? Hey, Missy. Just... That's. What else besides? According. To... <sighs> yes. That's. Played <sighs> right. Oh, my... Sorry, for safety reasons. If... Oh, that reminds... Well, no, you may not need... <sighs> if you feel... Oh, uh... Please, re I see. I heard some devon... Do you have friends? I want to... 
Excuse me, fella. It was only thanks to the dragon lich. You mean the friend in the you don't mind. If the shipping passages in Cloudford changed even a little, do you two know the I <laughs> I came this way. Um so, silent but deadly. Let me know when you're ready and we can set off. Silent. <laughs> hmm? I heard they anyway, the high Any danger, okay? Blade and flush! Get! Land! 
How could the meeting? There's supposed to be a passage. Why can't I see it? Somebody used the Cloud Ford control panel to block the road with containers. Uh, I'm a. I told you. That. Let me see.
That's right. It, forgive my realm keeping. As I'm angst to more and more over them. We are a cave if you come speaking of which. I I'll be allowed I think it'll be while the club to an outsider. Correct. It refers to the author of such acts, they were decided it's hard to if you come across. Don't worry, I recently resent an unfortunate. You are a fresh. You need help.
I don't believe in ghosts. Come on, draw already. Excuse me. Do you? Who would mind? What do you say? Let's make it. Here we are. This is the place. Uh, allow me to decipher if you wish, please. Excuse me. What are you all you this of course? Excessive. Calm yourself. Sure, but no need to decide. It's time. Huh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We are. I... Very well. Good. Listen, you and that way, we. Oh. Uh. <laughs> so, have you prepared? And you? <laughs> then. Well, then. What magnificent skill! He was fierce. I'm glad. Purple chrysanthemum. Oh. A long hmm. As so in any well. <sighs> Those people are wait. <laughs> I should report back. agreed to meet me here, but there's a letter here. The disciples sure know how to keep a look if they're looking to...
I don't believe in it. Extractor clean to your star What's written? I'll use my phone. Mauve Moon. This is Grey Peony. This is Mauve Moon, the head of our operations in Exalting Sanctum. It seems you have some... No need for modesty. You seem like you've got it all figured out. What brings you to the Disciples of Sanctum? I can appreciate that. The devil. They use deceit and power to... The mission of the disciple. Here, take this prescription. Through this medicine, you will become... The disciple responsible for creating medicinal pellets heard of your ex... Some of the ingredients can be purchased at an apothecary, but others will require you to come... Do you have any? I'm a shit. I fortunate now. Wait, M idiot. I, I detest mercy in that case.
So Mav Moon was the agent that Ching Zhu lost contact with. He joined the Disciples of Sanctus Medicus. I should go to the Seat of Divine Foresight and tell Ching Zhu. I don't know if this mission was a success or a failure. operation was a success. Although your identity was ultimately exposed, you gained a <sighs> you did you've met and for us there anything else? The pers there are a given that the dis if you turn up Divine foresight? Let me see the prescription. Oh, heavens above. It's a go and she may be. She's no chills. You can find. I've been looking. I heard from other. Thank you. Hmm, the specific I could ha leave your cup. Say hi.
scratch. Help me improve! Blade and flight! Practice is over! Swords descend! <laughs> you the doctor? Protect everyone too. Oh, Mr. Sora. Yeah. I'm not afraid of you. Look out! Hold your breath. You pony! Yeah. Time for sword play. Strike the park. Let me tend your wounds. Hey! Yeah. <laughs> Disappear! 
here among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Ahead. Up for a scrap? of the past.
Shift the back. Enemies ahead. Up for a scrap?